So I decided to recombine the hives. Um, did anything experiment. And originally I put the queen back there, but then I saw a lot of bees here, so I figured, you know what, I just picked up the hive, really heavy, and drug it over here. And I'm curious, kind of like watching two anthills together. They're definitely interested in me. Who is this big guy here? They're fanning. I'm seeing if the other bees will also recognize and go in there. I don't see any fighting. So I'm going to let it sit here for the day and then I'll move it back over there. Let them sort themselves out. But, um,. Hopefully they're like, hey, we got our queen back. And I closed the, the queen's in there, the top's on, the uh, narrow entrance in order for her to get her smell back in the hive. If they do attack, her bees can defend the entrance until she does. But I'm just watching, I'm just gonna watch for a while and see what they're doing. All these flying bees are returning from the original queen hive, I just don't know. It's like, is this our place? There's probably the, I mean, obviously there's probably another queen little bit sent in there. It's gonna probably take some time for the other queen scent to permeate again throughout the hive. So what did I learn from this one week adventure? Well, sometimes you just gotta let nature do its course and if bees are gonna die, they're gonna die even though bees looking around the good news I mean my uh, covering my wax vegetable oil wax covering seems to be working really well
This pollen guys are just unsure. He's like, I know my entrance is here somewhere, but what happened? Come on. Ouch. So here's the queening chamber in here. And um, Not good dropping the phone in there, make a loud bang. That's not what we want to do with a hive. But I'm actually going to um, leave this cloth on top so the smell gets out more, her scent, and close it up. Get these frames out right now. I'm trying to get her smell out more so they get used to her. Hopefully I'm not creating a World War III here. Hi, right, well, we'll see what happens now. Hopefully her scent will waft out of the front more. A couple hours. Yeah, it's definitely chasing the other queen's the queen's bees off. So it's going to be interesting.
I'm gonna get some mesh and put over the queen hive too, just to give her the additional protection from those bees. Her former sisters, reuniting them. So I wasted a week messing around just to create chaos with my bees, you know. So what happens when you're new at beekeeping, trying to innovate, you're going to have failures. You know, life is full of failures, you learn, and I won't do this again. And I'm sure the bees will sort themselves out. I'll check back with them in an hour, see how they're, how they're doing. So hopefully, um, let's put this, make this a little bit smaller, so we get in. All right. Well, back to one hive. 